Hey, what's going on? Oh, that's awkward. Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm calling Captain here. I know you've missed me. Not really. But, uh, yeah, I've been gone for quite some time, and now I'm starting a new series. Hopefully, it'll actually last. This is, uh, World Reviews, and this one is by Arcalius, or Ar Arcalius. I don't even really know how to pronounce his name, but his link will be in the description below. This is one of his, uh, worlds that he made. This is called a Waterfall Base, and as you can see, you spawn right here. Um, of course, you're, you were in, you spawn in creative, so you have all this stuff in your hands, but you can change it to survival and stuff like that. And it's just a really good uh, start off for your base. It's a good location. You have a swamp over there. I haven't really done much exploring, but there's a big jungle over here with probably a couple temples in it. So that's probably nice. But um, as you can see, the entrances are not very secure. You can come through the waterfall, of course, and then you can just walk right in here. Um, that might be a problem, but you also get free uh, ink sacks as squids will just randomly die. Also, this entrance over here is a. Uh, very open, so and it's not lit up very well. So mobs are just gonna walk right in, and you kind of have to be ready for creepers. But got a little armor right here, which is really nice. You have a lot of couple, a lot of skylights, which is actually really cool, and you can uh, make some different stuff with it if you want. Um, so that's good. You have natural lighting in here. Not really a lot of torches. Um, you can always make doors if you want. Uh, but let's see. Let's go look at the this little bedroom area over here. So yeah, you have like a whole bunch of storage over here for like weapons and stuff like that. Obviously, um, if you're playing survival, you probably don't want to use spawns and diamond items, but you know, uh, or iron armor or stuff like that. But you know, uh, it, the more the better. <laughs> uh, so here we have like a nice little bedroom right here with the little kind of curtain, modern look thing. I don't know, it looks pretty cool. And then the whole cobweb thing looks pretty nice. Uh, again, the main thing is safety for this base. Uh, there's like open like you know, mobs can fall, oops, not meant to do that, uh, yeah, you can just fall, and, you know, mobs can walk right in, it's pretty dangerous, but, again, it's a really good storage area, over here, you have a really nice enchanting area, um, and it looks, overall, really, really nice, and the cobwebs, again, look amazing, so you have, like, an automatic smelter over here, so that's cool, and all the products just go out right here, which is also really nice, you have more storage, so you have like all these chests over here for storage, and then you have all these for storage, and you have shulker boxes just for like, you know, backpacks, I guess. Um, and I guess that, that is kind of it. It's a pretty small base. Um, I'm gonna go see if I can find anything else. Alright, as you can see, guys, I literally just walked like right over here. The base is literally right there in that little, you know, ravine area, not ravine, but little pond area over there and I literally just went this way and these are my coordinates as you can see and you got a nice little biome right here a small little peninsula island thingy it's a peninsula of uh, plains and you have desert good for sand and stuff like that and the you know the new mobs and stuff like that the husks and such um, and then I'm sure you can also find a couple of uh, temples and villages which will suit your uh, exploration needs and oh okay I just found this this is a savanna so you have like a lot of wood already it looks like there's some cows which are good for uh, the meat purposes of course and then I'll let you guys know if I find a, uh, uh, a village alright guys looks like I found a village um, it, these are my these are the coordinates of it so it's like literally right over here um, and it doesn't look like it has a blacksmith but it is in this cool dark forest biome. Oh, there is a blacksmith actually. Sweet. So check out. Uh, let's see what's in it. There are also some nice little mushrooms. Show you know mushroom lights and stuff like that. I'll show you guys how to make those later. But yeah, uh, it's a cool idea. So the chest you have a diamond. You got uh, five apples, two bread, two gold, and two saddles. That is a pretty good haul actually. If you just make the trek out here, it's definitely worth it in my opinion because you get two saddles, some gold, some food diamond which is actually pretty huge looks like this village does have um, some pretty good villagers some librarians and stuff like that you can always steal the librarians books to get you know more uh, for your enchantment needs but again there's also an enchantment table over there again you guys can always just like totally destroy the base and just use the world for you know, its purposes it's actually a pretty cool world a lot of biomes pretty close together uh, I don't know about the mining um, you know purposes and the stuff you could find but I'm sure you can find some pretty cool stuff this is a really good seed um, some really good plains some spruce or not spruce birch um, yeah so basically 
Uh, I'm going to wrap this video up right here. Alright guys, that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I know I haven't posted a video out in a while, but I mean, I just I kind of want to get back into it before summer starts, just so I'm not like, um, hey guys, what's going on? But, uh, yeah, I don't want to be bad when summer comes around. I want to get out good videos for you guys. I have a new skin coming soon, uh, totally revamping the channel, so uh, stay tuned for that. Look forward to that, and I'll see you all later. Take care. Bye.